This is KMAX News at 6. We have quite a bit of debt right now, <laughs> and it's going to take a lot of rain to get us back to even. Well, last night's rain was a start, and our farmers and all of us hope there's more on the way soon. And it's good to see you again. I'm Brian Mudd. And I'm Lauren Motter. After 47 consecutive days without any rainfall, last night's storms bringing some much needed moisture to the ground. KMAX Cameron Mendoza joins us from a farm in Idaloo with more on what this farmer expects after all that rain. Brian and Lauren, if you take a look behind me here, this is what a healthy wheat farm looks like out at Harmon Farms. The ground is saturated after last night's rainstorm, and Guy Harmon tells me even though it's not a drought buster, it's something. Uh, it was a big shock because I kind of just quit looking at the forecast. After more than 40 days without any significant rainfall, Guy Harmon with Harmon Farms was elated to see a downpour of rain especially with cotton season looming. Last night when it really started raining, I, I couldn't believe it. I just figured it would last like two minutes and go on, but this is a pretty decent rain. Last night's rain did wonders for his crops and soil with the recent dry spell, but there is a downside. It's been sandy and plus with the high winds, that's not helping at all. We've actually been doing more plowing than we wanted to because we're trying to bring some heavier dirt clods up to the surface. When it rains, the, uh, the rain pushes down the clay material in the soil and leaves the sand on top. So every time it rains, the sand is gonna blow as soon as the surface dries up. But Sean Wade with Plains Cotton Growers says Sunday's rain may be the light at the end of the tunnel. That, that certainly uh, improves our attitudes uh, and, and hopefully gives us some some uh, hope that you know the spring will kind of be shifting back more to that normal pattern. Harmon is one of those farmers holding on to hope and something his grandfather told him a long time ago. One thing my granddad always said was that if it'll rain on Easter Sunday, it rains the next four Sundays. So we'll see. <laughs> <laughs> and as far as cotton, Guy tells us planting season for them starts in May. Reporting from Harmon Farms, Cameron Mendoza, KMAC News.